Texas lines up to kick this one off, and we're just about set to get underway. He sends this one deep. Colorado State's coaching staff so confident they know they've got a guy that's one of the best running backs in the country and that they can just play their game and not worry about the factor on the road. Well, Brett, his big playability not only can give you big chunks of yards on the road, but more importantly, it can quiet this atmosphere and allow the quarterback in this offense just getting back and, and just being able to run and be able to communicate. And I think that's a big challenge for this team. So look for his big playability to maybe even out the atmosphere and give this offense a chance to be able to execute. First and 10. Ball on their own 41. Can see this very often from this running back. He just got gobbled up pretty deep in the backfield. Runs it again, and he stops short of the line of scrimmage. They couldn't get back to the line of scrimmage on that one. Well, I don't think they did a very good job of selling the pass. The defense was able to read the play and come right in there and make a nice stop. Third down now, and they need to get it inside the 49. Wants to go long and done. Missed him. They're going to be forced to punt it away here. Great hold by the defense. They were expecting the pass play, and they defended it very well. It looks like they're going to go after this punt. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. He'll take it from the 18. The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. Gains his way to the 40-yard line. Even if you're pulling for the other team, you've got to just admire this guy's speed. He is special. He fights forward to about the 40. Picked up a yard of anything on that run. The sophomore just stuck it to the ball carrier right there. That's a very good tackle. Bounds right around the 42 yard line. Quick strike to the receiver. They come out in an empty backfield. Got it and brought down immediately. That pass play went for nearly enough to keep moving, but they're stopped just short. Boy, that's tough. That is always a tough pill to swallow. Having to leave the field, knowing how close you came to converting on third down. You got to get those. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. They've got to play with some focus and smarts here. They don't want to make a mistake and suddenly find themselves trailing. Up the middle for a nice game. Gain of seven yards. That'll bring up second and three. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. Ready! He makes it to the 28-yard line. receiver and it's knocked away. Oh, excellent punt. Not great, but not bad either. As long as your main priorities are not turning the ball over and establishing solid field position, then you're headed in the right direction. I don't think either team has a clear advantage so far. Let's see if they can make some plays and get a little separation. 
He tackles him for a loss. I'll give the defense all the credit here. They had that one snuffed out from the start. It could have been an even bigger loss. From their own 27-yard line, it's second down. Here we go, here we go. Hey, kill, kill, kill! He fights forwards about the 29. The running back gets two on the carry. When a defense has help and run support from their corners, it takes a lot of pressure off the linebackers and safeties. Great play. Switch, switch, switch. Throws complete. He's got room to work. Well, they get all those yards, but come up just shy of the first. Good play call. Almost perfect execution, except for the fact that they're not going to get the first down. The punting team's got to give their kickers some time. He fields a punt at the 20. Got to wonder right now which offense is going to open this thing up a little bit. I think the answer will be which offensive coordinator is willing to take a chance or two to try to open some plays up. Because right now, not only are they losing the battle up front, but they're really not testing the defense downfield at all. Every drive is important in a tie game. I look for both sides to come out with some urgency. He's tackled. That's the 42. From their own 42-yard line, first down. He's brought down in the open field. That's good for two yards. That makes it second and eight. He's under pressure. And he's hit immediately. Quick throw. Third down, and they need to get it inside the 48. Quick out to his receiver, and he hits him hard at the 38. That's a game of 15 on the way. That makes it first and 10. What are you doing? From the 38-yard line, it's first down. Four down, four down. Zero, zero, Mike Green. Hey! Black 55! Run play, and he'll lose yards. We've played one. No score here. Set to resume action here in quarter number two. Deadlocked after the first 15 minutes. Watch number 12. Watch number 12. Let's go. Three. That's a great tackle at the 30. That'll bring up 32. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. Here we go, here we go. Tight right, tight right. Four Ready, block, 90. Check number six. Four four nine. Nine. He's gobbled up in the backfield. Colorado State is looking to go up by three. He gets it up, and it's long enough, and he got it! They 
line up to kick this one away. Sends it sailing downfield. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. A quarterback in the gun with five receivers. There he goes. Tackle at the 36-yard line. This is a nice run for the first down by this quarterback. And they're going to put six DBs on the field to counter that five-receiver look. Gets it out quickly. And he's taken down around the 45-yard line. Slings it. He's at the 40. Loose football. That was a close one, but the ball goes out of bounds. It's first and ten. Ball on the 34. across the middle to his tight end and down he goes at about the 23 yard line that one's more than good enough for the first down well Brad that is a great play by the quarterback to find his target past the marker to keep this drive moving he makes it out to maybe the 23 yard line that brings up second and nine Pulls it in, and he's in the open field. And they push him out around the nine-yard line. They come out in a five-wide set. Nice run there. Level at the three yard line. That's a deal. Here's the line. Here's the line. That makes this a good deal. Come on, come on. Touchdown, Texas. And he tacks on the extra point. A nice nine play, 76 yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. Brad, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. The score now, 7-3. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Down around the 27 yard line. That's a gain of two on the That makes it second and eight. From their own 27 yard line. Second down. Mike three. Here we go. Black 98. Black 98. Run, 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 run. He makes his way to about the 38. That's good for a gain of 11 yards. That makes it first and 10. Stays in bounds and made a nice catch. Looks like the defense played the run that time. With this offense, you've got to be ready for a pass on any down in any situation. From the 50, first down. He makes it out to maybe the 49-yard line. The Rams taking their first time out of the half. Drill at the 
43. Third and long now after the sack. He punts it away, and it's a great kick. This punt goes over the goal line, and this will be a touchback. You know, we're getting so used to pinball football with a lot of points. Kind of fun to see defenses play this well. Kind of refreshing, isn't it? I mean, every single week we call games, and you're seeing scores in the 30s and 40s. This is one of those low-scoring games. Which offense will get that big break? Eventually, it could be the team that wins it. Texas is up by four. Makes the first down catch. And they make the stop at the 33. They go with a screen here, and the halfback's got it. Tackled for a loss. The screen pass goes nowhere. Well, you got to take your hat off to the defense. All week, they preached over and over again how they were not going to let this kid use his speed in the open field, and they really shut him down that time. Throws it in a hurry. They'll bring him down at the 34-yard line. job by the defense of getting after that quarterback and right now I think they've got him with some happy feet he appears to be a bit rattled booming kick he makes it to the 28 yard line Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. And a nice catch there before he stepped out of bounds. That makes it first and ten. From their own 48-yard line. First down. Three down, three down. Three down, three down. Three down. This flag came from the defensive secondary. Let's see what the call is. Pass, Pass interference. interference. Defense. Defense. They're giving away three yards and only making life easier for the guys on the other side of the ball. From the 37 yard line, it's first down. Mike three. Mike three. Once and all, going deep. And he holds in the deep pass. Wow, how about that call to the tight end? Big payoff. Well, the offensive coordinator has wanted to incorporate this young player into their passing attack, and he couldn't have picked a better time to get him the ball. So the kicker will line up here and try to give his team a three-point lead with this extra point. He makes the PAT. Colorado State kicked this one off. He sends this one deep. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. I love the competitive spirit that we're seeing out on this field today. It looks like one team has the upper hand, and then the other comes right back in to be able to regain the lead. It's going to be an exciting finish. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Knocked out of bounds at the 34. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. Use their second timeout. Going 
for it all to the end zone. And he tackles him hard at the two. Scrambling around, keeps it, and he's got a touchdown. And he converts the extra point. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Last drive ended with as good a result as you can hope for, and I'm sure they'd like to replicate that here. As long as this quarterback has time to throw, then you can guarantee that he'll find the open man. The defense had that one called perfectly. That's a big play on that ball. From their own 21-yard line, Second down. We played a half. The Longhorns lead 14-10. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Steve Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. Things are straight defensive out there right now. David, what do these two offenses have to do to open this game up? Well, it's it's fun to watch because obviously I'm a defensive guy and I enjoy this, but when, you're, when your defense is executed at that kind of level, the offense has to be precise. I mean, you got to throw it in tight windows. you got to be willing to take some chances that you normally wouldn't have. How about some trick plays, maybe? I mean, when you're losing the battle in the trenches, you got to find some way to kind of even it out. Maybe get a little bit more options, some reverses, some double passes, something to loosen up this defense. Because right now, defenses are just winning out. Just about set to start the second half. What are you looking for? I I'm looking to see which team has that decided schematical advantage. And if they can find it, they'll blow holes three or four axe handles wide. Brad and Kirk will be there to call the second half. Welcome back to the action. Second half just about set to begin, and we got a tight game here. He just drills this one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Both squads are digging in now. Let's see what happens on this next drive. Texas holds a four-point lead. Fires out to his wideout. it out to his receiver in a hurry. And he's tackled at the 30-yard line. Gaining two yards. That'll make it 35. Let's eat it up. 40's a mic. 40's a mic. Hey, D-line, let's get in there. Let's get in there, Hal. Green two. Green nine. Blue 20. He's wrapped up for the sack. That brings us fourth and 15. And this one is a beauty. He's to the 40. Gets to about the 41-yard line. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. He's tackled at the 49-yard line. That makes it second and two. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. Mike three, Mike three. Combo, combo, combo. Let's go. 
Here's the give. He's taken down. Right around the 48-yard line. Short game there by the tailback, and he's still going to come away with a first down. Well, the defense closed in on him pretty quickly, but not before he picked up just enough yards for the first. Here we go. Boy, was he drilled as he let go of that football. Yeah, he's going to feel that one tomorrow. From the 48-yard line, second down. Made at the 46. I love the toughness here by this quarterback sitting in until the last second, trying to make a play downfield only to have this defense get to him. He's got to do a better job maybe feeling things out a little bit, but at least he has the awareness and a toughness to sit in that pocket. He really got a hold of that one. This one will go into the end zone, and they'll bring it out to the 20. The Rams have really surprised everybody in this football game. They have not been intimidated at all, which is great to see. The attitude and effort of this team has put them in a position where they got a shot to win this game here in the second half. We're about set to start things up again. Texas is up four. He scrambled. And he hits him hard at the 30. Come up short. Good tackle. Oh, excellent punt. He's to the 40. Tackle made at the 40. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. Oklahoma! He's at midfield. Makes it to the 47. That's a game of 13 on First down. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 47-yard line. Quick strike to the receiver. He gets hit out of bounds at about the 33-yard line. That's good for a gain of 14 yards. That makes it first and 10. Four down, four down. Watch number 12, watch number 12. Mike three. Throws, and that one's going to hit the ground incomplete. The defense really missed a golden opportunity there. That's what separates a good player from a great player. When you have a chance like that, you need to take advantage of it. Looking for the corner. And he's taken down around the 16-yard line. That's good for a gain of 17 yards. First down. First and 10. Ball on the 16-yard line. right around the 14-yard line. A two-yard run by the halfback. Nice play here by the senior to make the sure tackle. It's not very often that someone's able to shake this guy. From the 12 yard line. Third down. Three, three. 
Good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. It's up, and it is good. Even though they gave up a field goal here, that defense is feeling pretty good about themselves right now. It could have just as easily been a touchdown. Colorado State lines up for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. The Longhorns fans have got to be going crazy. It looked like they had this one in hand or could put it out of reach, and they haven't been able to do it. This is a tough game for the fans to watch because their team was so dominant early in the game, and now they've just gone cold, and they've allowed the opponent to get right back into this game. They better find something here to be able to try to get out of here with a win. And he's level at the 27. Texas is up one. Got it, but he's going to lose yards here. Number 17 on the tackle. That brings up third and ten. From their own 25-yard line, third down. Red two, three and eight. So with one quarter remaining, Texas leads 14-13. Back to the action here. Tight ball game in the fourth quarter. Yeah, check. Hey, Mike. Hey, no, no. Let's switch the mic right here. We go Mike 40. Mike 40. Go! Wow, a big stop there early in the fourth quarter. And the way this game has been played and how tight it's been, every defensive stop will be huge. Fourth and long here after the sack. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. And down he goes at the 40-yard line. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Here he goes. Brought down around the 50-yard line. Second Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. Mike three. Mike three. He's got the corner. He's out of bounds at the 38. Call it again at 12 yards. First down. Four down, four down. Mike three. Mike three. Combo. Come Slings it. Almost picked off. Brady drops the ball here. I don't know if he's starting to peek downfield and think about the return or what, but that ball's right in his hands. He just dropped it. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 38-yard line. The 10 fires out to his receiver. Touchdown, and they take the lead. Excellent play here by the quarterback, making the proper reads and finding his playmaker for the score. And the quarterback stays on the field as they try for the two-point conversion. He's in for the conversion. So with less than four minutes to go here in the fourth quarter, our score, 21-14, Colorado State. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. Here we go. 
Here comes the pressure. And he's going to be sacked for a loss. Eight yards on the play. That'll make it second and long. Defense looking for another sack in this second down and long situation. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. Black five, black. Get to that quickly. And they make the stop around the 25-yard line. The sub package in there defensively in this five wide receiver set. Got it. And he shoved out of bounds at the 34-yard line. Bring him down at about the 21. And they've got the dive package in there to try and deal with this five receiver look. They go back to him on a quick throw. He's knocked out of bounds at about the 13. than three minutes in the game. Hey, kill, kill, kill. Touchdown, Texas! That's his third trip to the end zone. And the defense has to be steaming right now. How do you let the same guy score three times on you? The extra point to tie this game up. He splits the uprights with the extra point. So that's a seven-play, 75-yard drive, and they come away with a touchdown. An amazing drive for this offense, outstanding execution. If you're the defense, you've got to do something to try to change things up to get this quarterback out of sync. 21-21 ball game. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. This is when things get a little prickly. You need your playmakers to really come through here. rid of this one. Even though they didn't sack him, the pressure was still enough to force a bad pass. If you can get in there and disrupt the pocket, then the quarterback is going to have a tougher time getting the ball to his playmakers. Inside give. Runs it left for a decent game. Makes the tackle. That's a gain of seven on the play. That makes it third down, three. and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Mike three. Mike three. Ready. Blue 88. Blue 88. Hot. And he is drilled at the 38-yard line. Number six makes the tackle at the 38-yard line. Double tight. Double first tight. down. A little more than two minutes to go in the fourth quarter. There's a very impressive open field tackle. From their own 49-yard line, it's first down. Makes a catch, and he's got nowhere to go. The cavalry's coming. Throws complete. He's got space to work. And he finally steps out at the 20-yard line. That makes it first and 10. From the 20-yard line, first down. Zero, zero, Mike, three. 
makes it to the 11. He tops 100 yards on the ground with that last run. Brad, you and I talked this week about what we thought he might be able to do against this defense, and clearly he has lived up to our expectation. And I got to believe that his consistency is going to be a big key in determining the outcome of the game. And he's tackled right around the 12-yard line. This is the ninth play of the current drive. Just a tremendous job by that defense, and their coordinator did a super job there to keep it this close in this ball game. And now the offense has got a chance to win it. The kick is up, and he's got it. up to kick and they might just kick it short and prevent a long return he just drills this one and it goes into the end zone down for a touchback the Longhorns have played poorly all day long that really doesn't matter right now they have played sloppy they're not going to be happy when they go back and look at the film on Monday but with all that being said they still have a chance to win this game and at the end of the day that's all that matters is trying to get that W Taken down at the 26-yard line. The Longhorns will use their first time out of the half. Second and nine. Ball on their own 26. On the draw, tackled in the backfield. And the defensive end comes up with a big play. Boy, he's quick as a cat, no question. He got tremendous penetration and was able to wrap him up for a loss there. He throws it. Tackle made at the 49-yard line. Throw in left. Incomplete pass. And this one comes to an end. Our final count in this game, 24-21, Colorado State. That's it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying thanks, and we'll see you soon.